hello guys welcome once again to our channel yes so my people i don't come again to tell una another sad story we don't struck our nollywood industry yes guys we have just lost another great icon in the industry i am talking about zulu adikwe who reportedly passed on guys it's indeed another painful scenario it's another um sad event that has struck us unexpectedly guys barely how many weeks after the loss of uh demise of junior pool we are now talking about another celebrity what is going on is this how we are going to be growing every day with the news of people dying 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 instead of hearing of achievement we are just hearing of different day last one will be happen where we never even finish to cry now we don't hear another one junior pool will not leave us at a very tender age and unexpectedly had caused a lot of pains in the minds of nigerians and the industry at large honestly people don't cry people don't cry for junior pope so there's some persons now they pity junior pope and the family went in don't leave behind don't come up on support in family now we never even finished to cry of that one we never even finished to see how we can move on you know from the um demise from the loss we've had so far and we're now hearing of another one Honestly, guys, it's just so annoying. Just so annoying. Instead of us to be hearing great, great achievements, we didn't hear the yes, a person don't die, this one don't die, this one don't die. If all the people now where they make us feel happy, people where they come our screen, come they make us laugh, they make us feel, you know, lively, come they leave us. How we want to cope, I don't understand because there are some persons that are depressed and they just want to clear off their mind. They say, okay, make a go play. By the time you end up not seeing those people that, you know, make you happy, make you feel lively, how do you expect such person to be happy? We are not happy on honestly it's not something it's not a good news about our industry it's not a good news about our country as as we all guys that is just the truth of it oh, my people it's indeed another painful scenario honestly i don't know we can, why we can't be happy for at least one full month or thereabouts without having to hear one tragic story or the other guys this veteran actors did has caused tears and heartbreak to both the industry and the masses at large honestly it's it has caused a lot of pain it has caused a lot of crisis that that's cause so many people you know coming out to ask questions what is really happening what is going on in our industry why are we always hearing sad news here and there every now and then people are hearing of this one is dead this one is dead this one is dead we cannot just be at peace but once you hear person as you say ah you know that actor where they will be out so movie the first thing that comes to our mind is how far hope say it never died that is just what comes to people my first thing when you hear of you know someone's name and someone is actually asking you do you know this person because the way they just they rampant these days it don't make us lose god it don't make our mind they change nobody years of achievement again nobody years of great things again we know say person go die last last we know that is very true but at least not now and people that is just that about that although it has happened it has happened there's nothing we can do to change it guys zulu adikwe um you know born on june 27 1955 is a prominent and outstanding actor and musician he is well known for his contributions to the nigerian entertainment industry those ones we don't date it we don't they make us you know we don't make nigerian industry go viral get fame and stuff like that people now know them because of this their actions and now living on it's quite sad guys guys the actor who actually rose to fame for his role as mr b in ken's role we was movie and so many other movies that he adventured in he was um you know born and raised in enugu state before moving to hostra to complete his primary and secondary school guys the nigerian film industry has once again been planned into mourning as another legendary nollywood actor zoli adikwe has died guys just like i had said it's really annoying and it's really sad in that um we have to lose another person honestly adequate death was um, announced by a movie producer stanley Nwoko in a post on his instagram page on tuesday guys uh, stanley uh, mourning adikwe he wrote rest in peace good actor yeah he was indeed a good actor whoever it is that has watched this man's movie that has seen this man movie you will know that this one's not the old old party we get level for industry we know how to perform very well this was not the people will be saying without giving them script you know just mere explanation on what you want them to do they will kill it out for you these are the people these are the people we are talking about guys and we have now lost them guys i think we gain recognition primarily um for portraying fatherly characters in nollywood films I I don't know how many of you have seen this movie just like i had said earlier this man they always ask papa you know father is an old man he's an old man but that doesn't mean he has to die 
because we are not doing you know he's not done serving us and we are not done viewing him that much so we, we never expected to lose him at this age so guys this man normally has um you know father 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 and all those parts it fits him very well it fits him very well and he does well he does perfectly well in all what it is he demand us honestly guys that just don't get the whole scene barely um two weeks after we lost junior pope and three other nollywood stars in a boat accident now we are talking about another movie star now nah, it's so painful it's so annoying many of you understand what i'm trying to i don't know how many of you get the whole scene it's just like in a family circle this week you your papa you can't you say your papa don't die you never even finish to they cry the one way they ground face face you never even fi- finish to let go of the memories you're now hearing that your mama don't follow john god forbid oh, i'm not praying for such i'm just trying to explain how painful it is to the industry and even we serve where they follow watch these things honestly few weeks just few weeks after we don't finish we don't hear say eh, junior pope don't everybody they cry the whole calabar the whole niger they shake every way lagos every way asaba we they just they shake say ah we don't lose this person we come the year of another one say zulu i think we don't die how how what thing happen i don't understand this whole thing honestly i don't understand that things like this they make parents now they talk to me their children are not going to move industry i'm not saying you know any organization where people know they die but it be like this industry this particular industry don't to they lose people they don't to they bury people anyhow today you go yes say this one don't die heart attack tomorrow you go yes say this one don't sleep you know wake up next tomorrow you go yes say this one don't go surgery if not for the fact that god just wanted to save this previous man that went for surgery for brain surgery and now he's alive to come out and tell us that he is strong you for don't hear another sad story guys that is just about that before we go into another section please let's do the usual exercise please guys click on the red button like subscribe and comment on this video uh, just drop a heart for this man he has he has tried his best and he's gone now he's gone we just need to pay him our last respect and move on with life that is just it even what i told people during the time of junior but we just need to pray console the family and you know move on with life because such is life you cannot dwell on the past we, we not go cry forever because it don't happen it don't happen no matter how you cry it's not going to bring this man back to life if for saying that tears they bring people come back like junior pope for day now because they act another movie said for an honestly guys please don't forget to turn on your notification bell so that whenever i drop a new video you'll be the first to see for those of you joining us we're actually talking about this veteran nollywood movie star zulu adikwe who reportedly passed away in the late hours of tuesday april 23rd 2024 just recently you know be saying that last year's story guys just recently it's trending right now in case you think i'm lying or i'm giving you um informations that are not verified please go check all your social media platform uh, you can even browse it you can search it it's everywhere it's everywhere guys but people it's indeed a sorrowful thing it's indeed a painful story to be um having a sad news every now and then without another good news what's happening like you they always say you don't die you don't die we know they you say eh, you don't stop or this celebrity don't buy house you don't buy car you don't do this now the rampant news is just dead and be like this year just carry deaths of nollywood actors and actresses because since this year come we don't the year of different dead different dead no achievement so far what's going on and like this kind of life will make person one go join the industry or waiting you know you know they impress us at all guys we just pray that god should take away this dead and everything from our place because if it continues like this, a lot of people might want to drop from the industry. And even the ones we don't drop, go they, ah, uh, uh, thank God I've been telling them, say, made st- uh, and all those stuff like this. It doesn't make sense, guys. All right, my people, that is just that for that. All our prayer is that God should still stay in their life, the ones that are left. And also comfort the family of the deceased, because that is all what they need right now. It's just comfort that is what is left for them right now. To bring back the man, it's impossible. All what we have to pray for is that God should sustain the life of other Nollywood actors and actresses in the house okay guys thank you so much for your time i really appreciate but please before we leave let's do the usual exercise once again click on the bell subscribe like and comment on this video and do not forget to turn on your notification bell so that whenever we drop a video you'll be the first to see thank you so much for your time and stay tuned for our next update guys